Hello and welcome to Coxie's Picks and today we're going to be looking at the ASP Sentry or the S100. There is a window exploit that I'd like to discuss with you and it involves putting this in the half bow, making the bow move just half a tooth in and then we're going to use the double lock bar by pushing away and we're going to form a nice compression fit between the double lock bar and the pulls. Then we put a second movement onto the pull and that's it, we'll be able to open it up. So it'll be, be end up self shimming a bit like the old Claduso. ASP have helped us out by giving us this visual indicator when we're in the half bow position. As you can see, the tooth is completely obscured. That's the half. A fraction more, that's the full. So we've got a visual indication of when we're in the half. So all we need to do is line it up. Get my fingers in the right place. So let's do it nice and easy for me. Okay. Get it so that I'm actually doing it. There we go. So we're on the half. Once we're on the half, we're then going to lean against and apply tension on this. So it'll feel nice and stiff. Then we're going to push on the bow again. So once I've got my tension, I'm going to push on the bow again. And that's it. It opens up. So we'll just go again. Get it on the half. Push on the bow. And it opens up. Notice that the double lock didn't action at all. So the true litmus test of whether this exploit is useful or not is whether it can be done whilst you're wearing it. So let's stick them on and see if it can be done. Right, here we go. Let's get these on then, shall we? So ASP, over they go. Nicely done. So we've got the cuffs on. Before what we want to do is we want to get ourselves the spike and we're going to lightly place it into the, um, into the double lock window. We're then going to get the teeth in the half position. So in it comes, like so. Then apply tension. And that should be us free, just like that. So it's easy to do on the one hand. And let's try again on the second hand. So as you can see, we've been there. No tension yet, because we don't want to set the double lock, but we do want to move the teeth in half, then apply our tension, and then the cuff will undo. And that is the ASP version of the window exploit. So as you can see, this exploit is well and truly achievable whilst wearing it. Uh, admittedly, the difficulty factor will go through the roof if it was behind your back and you couldn't see what you were doing, especially seeing as you're going by feel. However, I reckon with a bit of practice, this could be achieved. This exploit isn't just on the ASP Sentry. It is backwards compatible, but I do not recommend you do it because on the older ASPs, they made the bar out of plastic and you will create additional wear and tear on your cuff. And in the long run, that will damage it. Yes, you can replace the mechanisms on the older ones, but why give yourself the misfortune of having a broken cuff? So, there we are. That is the ASP window exploit. Thank you very much for watching, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!